welcome to Mail Time with Brian. Yeah, it, it's going to be solo. Just me today. No dogs, no Lene. I'm sorry, but if I get anything for Lene or the dogs, they are upstairs. Lene is streaming right now on her Twitch. I'm going to go upstairs and show her stuff because uh, the success from the last video. Thank you, everyone, for all the comments about, yes, th those drinks. Oh, yeah, I love those drinks. No, 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 babe, no. <laughs> it tastes like oil. Don't drink that. Never again. Please don't put them on the list ever again. Disgusting. Now that I know. Anyway, uh, I'm going to be opening up uh, more boxes from Amazon. This was a weird one because when these boxes, when this list pretty much, well, the video went live on Christmas Day. So everyone that was getting stuff off of the wish list, kind of on Amazon, there's kind of like this, uh, this lull, this dead period uh, between Christmas Day and I think it's like the 3rd of January when things really kick back open again because I think New Year's could have been on a weekend. Anyway, there was a period where no nothing arrived and then everything like arrived at my doorstep in the space of two maybe three days i don't think anything else has arrived it's uh pretty much means everything on the list has now been bought thank you i really do mean it thank you everyone that's been getting involved in the wishes videos it is really cool i enjoy doing this because it's a great way to connect with the community and it's a lot of fun and i get a, uh i get some funkos and amiibos and records which is really cool i do enjoy uh collecting stuff and oddly i'm really getting into watching youtube videos where people buy and sell stuff on like amazon so kind of collecting stuff it's morally you know people who collect stuff now I want to start, like, doing other stuff. I want to do, like, GameCube and, like, old Nintendo stuff. N64. If you have some good recommendations for, like, channels in that kind of field, let me know down below in the comment section. Now, on to the wishlist stuff. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. First box. Guessing it's a Funko. We need to start laying off the Funkos because it's getting a little bit crazy. I'm turning into a Funko-only channel. I uh, hope your day is going well. You always brighten my day with uploads from uh, Dragon uh, Dragon Scythe. Can I say Drago? Am I pronounced that right? Dragon Scythe. Hope your day is going well. You always brighten my day with the uploads from Dragon Scythe. I think I pronounced that name right. All right, let's see what you got. It's definitely a Funko. I can't see what it is. It is bubble wrap. So this is good. Uh, I think this is from a third party seller. Amazon normally just have these like boxes, these little cardboard boxes for Funkos and they just send it to you. And if they get damaged, they'll just send another one. Uh, but this seems like it's been properly wrapped from someone who actually gives a shit. Shout out to all the Funko collectors and sellers that actually give a shit. Here we, oh, I can't even, oh, it's, pr okay, I know, I do know what this is. But I won't ruin the surprise. Now, would you guys get mad if I told you something that you would think me, of all people in the group, would not say this? And I think I've said this before. Alan... Alan Dutch... Oh, this is when he's covered in shit. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's kind of cool. Alan Dutch Schaefer. I'll be honest with you. I know I've done, like, Arnold's voice and stuff, but I have not watched Predator from start to finish. I've watched little uh, chunks. You know, little... Just all the catchphrases. Like, get to the chopper! If it bleeds, we can kill it. Though. All those little fucking little scenes. But I have not sat down and watched the entirety of Predator at all. Which is kind of sacrilegious to some people, considering... He's the Arnold guy! And he doesn't watch much. But I will take that very much. Thank you very, very much. I will watch Predator now because of that Funko Pop. So I don't think there's going to be an... Yeah, it's a mug. <laughs> it's definitely a mug. I don't think there's going to be a, a note with this one. Again, like I always say, I do apologize if you do write a note and it doesn't come with the item. It's probably because it's, you know, fulfilled by Amazon, but it's being shipped or sent by a third-party seller. Something where it, Amazon can't actually put the note in the item because it's just being shipped from somewhere else. So if you do send anything, please, please don't feel like I ever ignore the notes. We always try to make sure we read them. And this is actually a really cool mug. <laughs> That's actually really cool. America's ass. Captain America uh, themed <laughs> mug. America's ass. That's pretty dope. I will happily drink out of America's ass any day. Next item. Let's switch it up. Actually, no, it's not really switched up. This is just a, a kind of like going with boxes that I know are not from Amazon, if that makes sense. Some of the, you know, more rougher boxes. Not the Amazon Prime labeled boxes. But this is definitely a Funko. This is, I've already seen the top of it. I know the theme. I'm not going to ruin the surprise. But this Funko is... what is that a gay pride Batman? I didn't even know this was a thing. That's sick looking. That is actually pretty dope. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Some Kappa Prides in the chat, please. Speaking of Kappa Prides... <laughs> 
Let me take this opportunity to sell out my Twitch. By the way, thank you everyone that's been coming over to my Twitch channel. I have been streaming more on Twitch of late, playing uh, Wind Waker using crowd control, which is like this uh, software where people are able to like, they can use their bits. It sounds so weird. They can use their Twitch bits to interact with the game. So like I play the game and people can make me die, can make me explode. Just really kind of fuck me over. Some people try to help me. This is just for you. And I just want to say thank you to everyone that's been coming over to the Twitch channel and following and all the gift subs have been insane. We nearly have, I think, like 2.7 thousand subscribers on Twitch, which is awesome. What a way to start the year. So I just want to say thank you so much, everyone that's come over to the Twitch streams. They have a lot of fun. If you haven't come on, uh, come over, check out the description. There's going to be a link there, twitch.tv forward slash terrorize. Go over there, give it a follow. I'll let you know when I go live next. But people who've been enjoying the YouTube streams, don't worry, they're not ending, okay? What I'm planning to do on the channel is when I have, let's say, five videos uh, for the week, those two days without a video, I'm going to be doing a live stream on YouTube. And that's the best way for me to do it. And then all the other live streams will be on my Twitch. So make sure you follow me on both. If you're not subscribed to my channel here, that's fine. I'm not going to be one of these YouTube. Please subscribe, please, please. I want to get to 4 million subs. It's free. And hit the notification bell. I'll be honest with you, lads. The last year, 2020 was really... 2021, holy fuck. Fuck, COVID-19 has made my brain fuck. 2021 was a really shit year. Uh, not only, like, analytically, like, you can say it, like, that could be what I'm talking about, but really, in general, of making videos, 2021 kind of sucked. It's not really a year I'm going to put down as saying, that was a fucking great year. Lately, doing the Gmod stuff, like, I recorded some stuff this morning with Evan. And I don't know, I'm just getting this weird kind of, like, I don't know if it's that nostalgia feel, but, like, making videos properly again has been really making me happy i don't know we did some more we did a john wick style thing this morning we did the matrix video the other day i've just been really enjoying making videos again and i can really tell in my i guess mindset i'm a lot more enthused that's why i'm oddly happy and also the tiktok videos uh people really enjoying nogla and i doing tiktok together is actually a lot of fun uh i hate tiktok still but i do enjoy recording them with nogla and uh, the feedback from the community has been really good so yeah a lot of optimism so yeah thanks appreciate it and also i feel the love over on my twitch channel so again triple thanks i think i'm high on happiness it's a funko pop lads we might need to rethink the whole funko pop on the on the wish list because i feel this is for people who actually collect funko pops i feel like a fraud there's probably people seeing all the funko pops that i get and they're like stupid son of a bitch he got a cap of pride batman i've been looking for that forever i'm sure some of these are very common because they're on amazon but i just feel like this is very you guys are too generous Oh, you can fuck off. Oh, you can fuck off. No, no. Uh, actually, f no, fuck your generosity. Five Nights at fucking Freddy's. Twisted Chica. Is this the new thing now? What is the Twisted Ones? Obviously, I don't stay tuned in with uh, Five Nights at Freddy's because I hate it. Thanks, everyone that keeps asking. You gonna play more? You gonna play more Five Nights at Freddy? Jesus Christ, I hate the idea of playing this fucking game. Uh, but I know there's like... Whoa, oh, S -S T T C P S S T C P S. Uh, I can't remember what it's called. That's a new thing. I don't know if this has anything to do with it. Oh, thanks. Thanks very much. It's a Funko Pop, and I can't help but see which one it is already. I actually want some of you who know your Funko Pops in the comment section. Let me know if any of these are actually pretty good. I'm sure there's some common ones that people kind of look past. If there's ones you're like, oh, that's actually a good one. Protect that one. You know, you should really treat that one like a princess. This one is the Bruce Lee. Uh, I don't know if this is just the, the, drag, the, the, the flying kick version. There's different ones here on the back. You can see the different ones. I obviously have the 592 on there. It came in the protector thing. Exclusive bait. I don't know who bait is as uh, in Mad Max. That's bait. Is this good? I don't know. But it came with a nice protective shell. And I appreciate them for that. Because Bruce is a treasure. And he should be protected. Hi, you and your videos helped me through a lot uh, of my anxiety and depression. And supported my brother through his chemo. 
he's all clear now. Let's go. Good to hear. Uh, so to say thank you, here's a present from Shauna and Connor. Shauna, thank you so much. And Connor, I'm fuck, I'm delighted to hear that for you, man. Okay. Hope you're recovering nicely and everything gets better for your brother. Much love to you both. All right. Okay. Let's see what you got me. I guess I can accept this. You know, I guess. It feels like a Funko Pop. And it's in the bubble wrap, which to me, third party seller. So this could be a good one. It is a Funko Pop indeed. I don't know what it is. It's in a soft shell, it's not a hard case. Oh, no way. I literally just did your voice this morning. And I actually, and I watched I watched a bunch of clips to practice. I won't say I'm great at the voice, but Evan and I had some fun with this. Uh, John Wick with the lovely pupper. Sad story. Uh, don't watch the movie if you if you if you get too attached to that dog that, that you're seeing on the screen right now. Uh, a little bit of a dent, I think I see in John's forehead. Don't know if you can see that. If you can get it. there, you go. You can see a little bit of a dent in John. That's still good. I don't know. I'm sure, like in time, John Wick will become super collectible. Uh, I wish I had more knowledge on Funko Pops. So I'm just gonna collect them and. Trust you guys in the comment section to let me know if any of these actually have potential of, of being quite valuable. So, Shauna and Connor, thank you for the John Wick. I'm a huge fan of Keanu in general and the John Wick movies. And coincidentally, just did a skit on him this morning. Good timing. So, this is from Courtney that just got the pups some beers. I'm going to go upstairs. Lene is streaming right now. Sansa is behind her, most likely. I can get the stream up here now. They squeak. I don't want to make too much noise, or else they'll see me. Ooh-wee! Didn't work. <laughs> She's got her pup live. <laughs> it's so cute. Alright, that was good. You got to see the dogs. Now, this one is definitely not a Funko Pop. It isn't a sword, and it's kind of cool. Is it Lucius Malfoy? Is that Draco's dad? This, I believe, is his walking stick with his wand that goes into the top. That's kind of dope. Not gonna lie, that's kind of cool. So he would... And then out with his wand. That's pretty goddamn cool. Who got me that? There's no note. That is a cool piece. That is a cool piece. I, I do like that. That was a little bit different. Thank you for that one. All right, let's open up some packages. Switch it up here. So you can catch them all. Thank you for the funny content. This year was a funny one from Honeyberry, Erica, and Tony. Even though I said I felt like it wasn't a funny year. <laughs> these for the dogs? Mini Pokeball. Like, do they squeak? No, these aren't for the dogs. These, oh, these make good for Christmas decorations. They're just on little chains. I wouldn't give these to the dogs because of the chain. But I, I'd, uh, I'd use these as Christmas ornaments. Thank you. I got a glimpse. You you guys are evil. Evil to my waistline. This is not right. This is not right. Sorry. <laughs> Read that. Sorry for your waistline, but thanks for all the content. Uh, you're great for depression from April Christmas. April, keep your head up. Hope things are getting better for you. Much love. I'm glad the videos can help. Uh, but at the same time, you naughty, naughty thing you. This is not right. This should not be allowed. I should not be putting this in the video to encourage this to happen yet again. Because these are not good for you, ladies and gentlemen. They are not good for your waistline. It is imperative that you listen to me and say that eating your greens and your veggies are imperative for your growth in this world. Do not, and I warn you, do not ever, especially out of the fridge, Especially fresh out of the fridge. No. Oh, God damn. It's been a while. Thank you. I'm not exaggerating. Crunchies are so good. And Flake, ladies and gentlemen, if you ever get these, sure, I don't know if you even have these in America. I don't know. Get yourself some vanilla, just vanilla ice cream. And this... Crumble this up, break it up, just scatter it around the ice cream. Thank me later. This is always in ice cream back home in Ireland. You get an ice cream, a soft serve, as you Americans like to call it, soft serve. It's a 99 back home, and you get a flake in the top. Oh, oh, stop. <sighs> yeah. Thanks for that. April, you just became one of my favorites. I ain't gonna lie. Thank you.
Next item. Hopefully it's not bad for my waistline. It's hard. So she's in. It's not any food, I don't believe. I'm not looking down. Try not to ruin it. Hi, Brian. I've been watching your content for a little over two years now, and you've always been a consistent source for a good laugh. Thanks for that. Hope you have a great 2022 from Tambiani. And in bracket says Paige. Paige, thank you so much. What is this? Thank you for your purchase. What is this? It's just a wooden box. It says Fun Fams. Burnt into the bottom. <gasps> oh, yeah! yeah! Fucker, yeah, you fuck off. Oh, I didn't like that. I didn't like that. Did not, no. You can fuck off, Paige. How about that? Why did they get... I don't... I don't... Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Fuck <laughs> you! My fucking ears, woman. <laughs> was great because I put it down. She opened that pretty quick. I was literally out the room and all I heard behind me was, ah! <laughs> oh, GG's. G motherfucker G's. <laughs> ah, yes. Uh, I like it. Good job. Good job. Since Noglas sucked you into, he, what did he do to me? Into TCG. Here's some more packs to collect. I hope you open one with Lene from Honeyberry Erica. What the fuck is TCG? Please tell me these are not po What? Are you serious? These are Pokemon cards. Oh my god, they are Pokemon cards. Oh sweet Jesus. I don't know anything about these. I don't know how many from the front I'm supposed to do. Uh, do you want me to open these with Lene? Okay, let's give it a go. See how this goes. Okay, that was a little bit of a disaster. I don't know much about Pokemon cards. She definitely doesn't know much. Uh, so I think she kind of mixed some stuff up. But the best stuff we got from there was uh, Zeb Striker, Porygon Z, more Pico, uh, Victini V Full Art, and uh, Lee Van. Yeah, if any of those cards are decent, feel free to let me know. But I'm pretty confident I can send these to Nogla and said, Are any of these worth a Bugatti? Let me text them now. Any of these worth a Bugatti? We'll see what he says. Uh, Erica, Honeyberry, thank you so much for getting me these. This is, I was really not expecting Pokemon cards. Am I gonna stop? Am I gonna object to people doing that? Not at all, because I think it's really cool. The reason I don't get Pokemon cards is because it. I find I'm kind of scared. Uh, I don't know it too well, and I'm afraid of paying way too much and getting ripped off. Uh, yeah, but I do have an excitement and a liking for Pokemon that I would enjoy it, but I just, it's just an, er an area that I don't have much expertise, and I feel like I would get ripped off and screw up. But thank you for these. These were great. I really enjoyed that. That was a surprise. Wasn't expecting that. This next one came with no note. I think it's something for my bar. The old Irish pub, experienced drinkers only, good friends, good drinks, good times. That's good. That'll go up on the wall. That's a good one. Thank you very much. Whoever got me this, there's no note. Lovely little piece. A little, uh, what do we call them? Uh, knickknacks is what we call them. Uh, that go on the wall. That's really cool. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, ew! No, you say you don't like Mexican candy. No, 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 no. I, but I hope these would change your mind. No, 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 no. Uh, been a fan since your Among Us days. Ew. Among Us. Uh, and have watched all your videos since and enjoy a happy new year from Dora Herrera. Dora, thank you so much. Can you say, I hate watermelon? Muy bien. I fucking hate watermelon. I don't get it, lads. I really, really don't get the flavor of watermelon. I don't get why people like it, so. I will do one for you. I got the whip. I had these before. I had these before. I hate them. They're red. They're red. I get. Yeah, 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 yeah. I. Okay, three, two, one. Uh, Viva la Mexico. Like 
in the sand. I remember, no, I don't like it. Oh, the only people that pay cool. Mr. Worldwide, that's a trio six. Remix. Oh, oi. Mo, muchas gracias uh, para, para Watermelon. Uh, do, uh, I, uh, uh, I hate it. I fucking hate it. <laughs> oh, okay, I tried. <laughs> Oh, no, fucking. Muchas gracias. Thank you so much uh, for watching. I appreciate it. I'll keep these for when Nogla visits. <laughs> Watermelon flavor covered with chili powder. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Next box. It is an amiibo, ladies and gentlemen. No note. Third party seller. Uh, I Captain John. Oh, Modern Warfare. Captain John Price. Alpha Team. Team Alpha going dark. I can't remember. Name John Price. Fucking cool. It's pretty dope looking, isn't it? Uh, has he got dirt all over him? Oh, nice. It's a dirty version. So that's that's meant. You, don't worry. It's not your screens. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Good, and it's also in a nice protective case. Fantastic edition. Thank you very much. Whoever sent that. Sorry, there's no note, but I appreciate it. Thank you. Still a bit of Mexican sand. Jeez. That shit doesn't go away. Uh, hey, Brian, I've been watching you and the crew since I was in sixth grade and love watching your videos. They always make me laugh. Enjoy the amiibo. Alicia Benitez. Alicia, thank you very much. Amiibo. I always get excited when amiibo is sent. Let's go. Oh, yes. Oh, Japanese version. Let's go. So it's Toon Link, Wind Waker Toon Link from uh, Japan. I love the ja I just love, I just love Japan. I love the text, the the art style, everything. Just something about Japan it just gets me feeling some kind of way. And I really want to be careful. I don't want to damage this. This is kind of oh, badly packaged. I would, I'd prefer if they just use big like air packets in the box. This is just lo this is just overkill. Oh, after a half hour, we finally got it off. Uh, the cardboard's a little bit bent. It's not too bad. Yeah, two link, Japanese version. I I'll just say it. Like, I don't know if the Japanese versions are more expensive or less expensive. I don't know. I don't care. It just, you ca you have to admit, look at that in the top corner. It just looks so much cooler. Alicia, thank you so much for the amiibo. Really appreciate it. That's going to be a great addition. Very happy with that. Thank you. Are you fucking kidding? Really? Like, this couldn't get any worse for me. I'll be right back. There's no no with this one, and probably for good reason. Hi, my name is Ash Ketchum, and I'm legally obligated to let you know I'm on a sex registered. <sighs> Can't even say it. I got my Pokemon cards. I'm 30. <sighs> Oh, here's the note. Because we all wanted to be a Pokemon trainer at some point in our lives. Honeyberry. Had I known that was there, I would have worn that while doing the Pokemon cards. Thank you. Thank you, Erica. I appreciate it. And yes, I'm aware of the pompadour hairstyle. You don't have to comment on it. I am getting a haircut soon. Just hairdressers been booked up for the new year. What is this? I don't even know what this is. It feels weird. For him, birthday. 12-inch premium. Metallic latex blue. What? This would be great for my birthday. Do they all say this? Ow, what the fuck? It actually hit me. This one says... Feel free to gift this. Feel free to gift this for someone's, someone's actual birthday. My birthday is coming up. Hey, Brian, thanks again for everything. If this stuff doesn't make your, I guess, ass pucker, then nothing will from Justin Faust. Ladies and gentlemen, I have heard about this stuff. Toxic waste. Hazardly sour candy. I have never tried this. In my 30 years on this planet, my lips and tongue have yet to meet the warm, sour embrace of this famous sour candy. I shall be the judge. Uh, is it actually sour? Or is it full of shit? Oh, they come in little pebbles. For some reason, I thought this was filled with like a powder. I didn't know what to expect. I'm gonna go with lemon flavored because I love lemon. And when you think of sour, you always think of lemon. Ain't nothing 
Dropped it, caught it still. <laughs> Oh, this is good. Heavy concentration, not too heavy. It's fluttering on the level of overwhelming, but it didn't go over. No, I didn't book her. I'd say if I did three of them, let's do three lemon at once. And I think that would be the point where I go, mmm. One was okay. It's definitely sour, but for toxic waste and how much, it's like a fable thing for a non-American. You always, you always hear about toxic waste as a sour candy, but I've never had one. Here we go, free toxic waste. Let's see. This should make me grimace pretty good. It's a bit too chemically. Like battery acid. Yeah. Oh, no. It feels like I just had battery acid in my mouth there. That kind of chemical sour. Not that natural kind of overwhelming. Oh, mm. Um, it's not sour now at this point. All the sour is gone. Not great. Yeah, not a fan. Not a fan of these. It's, um, it is sour, but it's not an enjoyable sour. I like a, a sour sensation that is enjoyable. You know what I mean? It goes over that threshold of just like, oh, this is, this is probably taking years off my life. This isn't really meant to be consumed for human digestion or human consumption. And, but I wouldn't say it's, I don't think I got like, like, oh, 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 oh. it's like a 5.2 out of the sour scale. I didn't really enjoy it. Yes, it's sour, but like, that's what happens when you put a bunch of chemicals. It tastes chemically. Like, it doesn't taste like it's actually a sour kind of fruit or sour jelly. It's just sucking on a battery. Um, didn't really enjoy it, so... And also, the Mexican candy didn't really help, so... Not a good day for the old tongue. My tongue is like... No more, please! What the fuck? Just want to say I love your videos so much. Ever since I found them, I've watched them and your friends more than I do regular TV. Thanks for making me laugh during the pandemic. Enjoy the gift and Happy New Year from Dora Herrera. Dora, thank you again. Another one from Dora. What the... F what is this? Is this a flat... Oh my... The best activities for your health are pumping and pump. Arnold, you get me demonetized. <laughs> Thank you. I hope you got this book. This is the second book I'm sending to you. I don't know if you received the other two copies. Uh, so let me know in your videos, uh, part two, two from Alexander. And it's this book, uh, Downfall of the Striker, Rise of Dragons. I'll give it a read. Next item, and the perfect cleaning brush for your Irish pub. Cosplay love. <sighs> it's a cleaning potato. Oh my God, it's got a scrubber on the back. Oh my God. P it's a potato scrubber. Racist. <laughs> oh my God, Cosplay love, another one. Well, now you are a Pokemon YouTuber. I thought you might like this movie from Cosplay love. Oh, Detective Pikachu. I do like this movie. This was surprisingly very enjoyable. When this movie was coming out, I felt like I wasn't gonna like it. I did. Very good. I don't know why you think I'm now a Pokemon YouTuber. Send, 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 send more. This is. This is gonna be some sour sweets, sour candy. I feel it. My tongue is dreading it. Hi, Brian. I realized I ruined the surprise after I sent it. Sorry, hope this makes up for it. And by the way, you said my first name wrong. It's more pronounced Rian. Rian Burns. Rian. Rian Burns. Got it. What is this? Legend of Zelda. Anything Zelda makes me smile. It's a box. I guess it's gonna have cool little Triforce or some little things on the inside. Oh no, I don't like the way I was shaking it around. Oh, it's sour candies. <laughs> He's probably watching like, no, don't shake it. It's going to be this glass piece, a beautiful arena or something. And it's now broken and the box is damaged. My, my, my. Ah. So it's got the, the boss key. So you have the shield. So it's like a little necklace making kit. You make like a medallion. And you use one of these different charms. You got the shield, uh, the boot, the ma uh, the key for the uh, the boss dungeon key. Now, what are these? Is this from Breath of the Wild? Which which Zelda is this? Please forgive me. I don't know if this is supposed to be from like Fire, Earth, and Wind. I don't know if they're temple icons. I can't remember. These the brace. This isn't Wind Waker. Is that also? <sighs> I'm so confused. I don't know which Zelda this is from. This is really cool, though. Thank you very much. I just wish I knew which Zelda this is from. Because it's making me have... One sec. I'm, I'm figuring this out. 
Nah, no wonder. This makes sense. It's Twilight Princess. And the reason why that makes sense to me is because I never finished Twilight Princess. Because it was on the Wii U. I wasn't really huge into it. I just didn't get super deep into, like, I did the beginning. Turned into the dog. But I didn't get super obsessed with Twilight Princess. Probably why I don't recognize some of these. Uh, that makes sense. But it's a little necklace kit. So, like, you get these chains. You can make your own little necklace. Hang it up. I have uh, the Master Sword and Shield hanging from up there so I can make a few of them and hang them around different places, even put them on the tree. Thank you. I'm hoping you don't have this one yet. Thanks for the funny videos during these times. They helped uh, de-stress me after a tough day of work. Cosplay love. Cosplay, you're buying the whole goddamn list. And it is uh, a Luna Lovegood Harry Potter Funko Pop. Yeah, there's a lot of Funko Pops from Harry Potter we haven't gotten yet, so this definitely has not been gone. So thank you so much, Cosplay. Appreciate it. Oh, are you fu- Oh no, I'm completely wrong! Here's something to add to the Funko collection. Enjoy from Amanda Coffee. First, I am becoming a Pokemon YouTube channel. Let's get these out of the way. I don't know if these are safe for dogs. We got some Pokeballs. And then I thought this was gonna be a duplicate, and then I realized it's not. It's Myron as Dementor in Jingle All The Way. Myron, come on! <laughs> That's amazing. That's so good. Now we have both. Let me get them. Boom, got them both. And Sinbad was so good in the movie. Some sick people in this world. Sick people. Perfect. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. Two more boxes. This one, I feel, is a Funko Pop. It's a big box, but it's light. It's in a bag, so it's in a gift bag. But I definitely feel this is going to be a Funko. Seeing as you like a certain artist, I hope you like this gift. By the way, I'm the one who sent you the Captain America and Darth Vader Funkos. The Darth Vader one was insanely sick. I uh, thought I put my full name uh, this time, and no, I'm not related to Clint. From Emily Eastwood. <laughs> Thank you, Emily. <laughs> Damn, that would've been cool. Thank you, the Darth Vader one was, oh. The box for the Vader Funko was ridiculous. Yeah, it is a Funko. No. Is this in a heart? No, it's in a cardboard box. Okay, I thought this was like extra protected. So it's definitely a Funko pop. Gonna try and bypass reading the name on the side. Ready? Ready? <sighs> Your Majesty! Freddy Macarena! Look at that. Look at that chest. What a... F Ooh, look at that man. Look at that man. I love that. That's sick. The fact that you guys know I love Queen is amazing. That's so good. My, my mom would love that. She loves Queen. She loves Freddy. That's so good. Emily Eastwood, thank you for the other two, the Darth Vader and the Captain America, but this is my favorite. My love for Freddy will never end. Thank you. And this is the last box for today. There's a bit of weight to this. Um, big enough box. And I think it's all in one giant bag. So it's in a gift bag. Watching your Mario Kart and Uno videos helped me deal with my anxiety from the amount of laughter. Uh, LOL, much love and respect from Northern Ireland, Glenn Wright. Glenn, appreciate it, man. Hope everything's good back home. Thank you very much for watching the videos. I appreciate it. Here we go to wrap up the video. What is this? Put my hand in. It's one solid square. Like, imagine a really heavy giant Funko. It's in the Amazon wrapping. I can't see what it is. Uh, I'm not gonna read any of the text. I don't know what's inside. Didn't read any text. Big box. We can't see what it is. Bit of a wait. Holy shit. Okay, I can see. Is this a box set of something? All I can see is this. Looks like a bunch of, like, Nintendo Switch games or something in there. Okay, still no idea what this is. Just a bunch of DVDs. What the fuck is that? Stargate? That is super random. Stargate? Are you guys telling me to watch Stargate? I've never watched an episode of Stargate in my life. A Stargate box set. That is the most random thing ever. Is this the complete series? Stargate SG-1. The complete series. Series season 1 to 10. Oh my god. Well... Is Stargate good? I never watched it. It was always on Sky 1 when I was growing up. That's the TV ch station it was on. I didn't watch it ever. Uh, all right. There we go. i give it a go. I could fall in love with it for all I know. Uh, there, that's it. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for all the Funko Pops, the Stargate season, the Sarah Cat... <laughs> The Pokemon stuff, really good and really big. Yes, 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 yes. And and the flake, uh, all yeah, lots of Pokemon stuff. 
this is great. Thank you so much. We have more boxes. I have to unbox more for another video. So if you send me something you don't see in this video, it's mostly going to be in the next one. So if you guys want to get involved with the wishlist videos, all you need to do is go over to my wishlist, which should be linked in the description. If you want to get anything added specifically onto the wishlist, what you need to do is this. If you're a subscriber on my Twitch channel, so like a Twitch Prime sub, you got a gifted sub or you just subscribe to my Twitch, or you're a member of my YouTube channel, please make sure you go over to my Discord and link your Discord account to your Twitch or YouTube account, and that way you're going to get access to all the private rooms in that server. So if you're not a member or a Twitch sub, Brenton, you can still go over to my Discord and there's a general chat and there's two voice chats, but if you become a member or a Twitch sub, you get access to all the exclusive rooms, and in one of those rooms is the Amazon uh, wishlist chat, and you can go into that chat and ask for things to be added on. That's how some of these people are getting their items added in there, and uh, yeah, that's basically the best way for you to get involved in the in these videos thank you so much everyone that gets stuff and gets involved it's a lot of fun uh always a surprise my tongue is on fire really enjoyed it i shall see you all in the next video thanks for watching if you're new to the channel be sure to hit the subscribe button leave a comment down below and i shall see you all next time Bye bye bye.